What's up? This is Squad Twenty Four Four Eight with a video. Today we'll be boating here in GTA Five with a giant yacht, and we'll be driving this brand new GT Three Nine Eleven RS over to the marina. We'll be hopping in the boat and going out today. So we'll be hopping inside this awesome car. This is a pretty cool mod, one of the coolest cars that I've seen in the game. So we'll be pulling out here from our apartment building, which overlooks the water. We'll be making our way over to the marina, and this is one very fast car you guys can see that we just went pretty fast looks like once this uh few vehicles kind of go we'll be taking a right and the marina is just around the corner i'm very excited to be back here in gt5 with some pretty cool mods and yet again doing a pretty cool boating video so it looks like we are good to go and we're gonna step on it i mean this is one awesome car it's the uh, pretty nice gt3 rs i really do like it and we made it over here to the marina in very little time like i was saying our apartment building already overlooks the water so we'll kind of cruise around here and we'll be parking up underneath the building kind of staying in the shade which should help us out just a little bit so we'll probably take up two spots here looks like nobody's really Really here but wow take a look this blue really does look good down here underneath inside the shades well that looks pretty good we are taking up two spots we do not want this epic porch to be scratched or damaged so it looks pretty good over there and you guys can see look at this giant yacht this is yet another very cool mod which I found and I mean this will be pretty cool to drive around so we'll hop over that and we'll be making our way down here if you do have any cool ideas for any GTA 5 videos let me know down below in the comments we'll switch here to first person I mean take a look at this this is like a 40 foot giant yacht this will be pretty interesting so we will definitely have to jump and we did that that pretty well next up we'll have to jump up here look at that guys we have a pretty cool couch a sink everything like that I mean this is just one epic boat then down below is where the beds are but this looks pretty cool I think we'll we'll most likely kind of go out kind of near the beach we'll stay the good distance we need from the shoreline and then we'll kind of jump on and off the boat which should be pretty cool so we'll kind of switch through the camera views one last time I do not uh, really want to be in that view next up we will have to unfreeze the boat which is pretty simple to do I do that so the boat does not float away maneuvering out of here will be a little challenging but we should be able to do we'll pull forward get on reverse and we do have to kind of swing the boat very wide in this uh, little area so, wow pretty close right there to the edge but looks like we are doing it and I would like to thank each and every one of you for the continued support on all the daily content. I really do like featuring GTA 5 videos as a second video and we'll definitely be featuring many more since this game is awesome. So we'll kind of head out you guys can see there's another yacht over there, a sailboat. Maybe we could do some sailing videos, something cool like that. But you guys can see that this boat is making a pretty large wake and we aren't really supposed to be making a large wake here, especially since this is uh, the no wake zone marina. Having a wake in the marina area could cause other boats gonna hit the docks really harder, even damage any of them. So we do not want to do that. Now we are going down this little river, and then the ocean is right over there, which is pretty cool. But take a look at this, guys. This is one epic boat. This is one pretty cool first person view. Looks like we are just going just about 10, but wow, I mean, this is one awesome boat. Very excited to have it. And I actually did do a few other boating videos in GTA 5. You guys can go check those out because, I mean, these are some pretty epic videos. Once we get out past this uh, buoy over here, we'll be opening up this yacht, seeing how fast it goes. Looks like it's a pretty calm day, which is also pretty helpful for us. But this boat will be able to, now we are full uh, throttle on the acceleration. And I mean, this boat does go pretty fast, especially for the size of it. And I mean, take a look at that. What one giant boat. You guys can see that there is a few airplanes up in the sky, jet skiers, everything like that. So overall, it's a pretty cool day. Next up, I really want to find a pretty good area to kind of uh, anchor out at. I think we'll kind of go past this area. But wow, there's a few other yachts over there, sailboat, even a jet skier. So I think we'll, we should kind of move in just a little bit, but we do have to watch out because we do not want to beach the boat or run aground and damage it. But we definitely want to enjoy this boat, kind of jump off it a few times. Wow! 
one crash down. That's a little too scary for me. Do not want to damage it. So I'm thinking we'll probably kind of dock up a little bit more inshore now. When we do freeze the boat, I do want to freeze it at a pretty good level. I'm thinking right about here looks to be good. So we'll kind of come in here and we will freeze the vehicle now the reason why I do freeze this will unfreeze it and let it drop now the reason why I do that is it will not let the boat move which is very helpful for us it is a, a little unrealistic at times but like I was saying we do not really want to be uh, swimming after the large boats so this is the way forced to anchor it but take a look at this view guys from shore uh, from the boat wow take a look you guys can see Los Santos looks pretty cool so we'll kind of walk about it looks like we are sitting here that looks pretty cool we'll kind of walk around the back but we'll be jumping off a few times then I think we will most likely do a little bit of driving around but these boats you aren't supposed to be like cruising around really really fast since it's more of like a pretty nice boat but you guys can see everything looks pretty cool so now I think it's time for us to go for a swim once and then we will kind of uh call it a day out here on the water so we'll kind of jump up here now sometimes these boats aren't made for us but let's give it a try we'll jump in take a look at that wow that was actually pretty cool it looks like we went for a swim now we have to hop back on the boat and we'll kind of do a little bit more boating before we head back kind of walk back on the inside this is overall a pretty cool boat if you do have any cool GTA 5 ideas drop them down below in the comments I'm very excited for all these very cool videos we'll unfreeze this now it's back to floating and I mean take a look at this view that's pretty cool it has a lot of different camera views which is also nice so we'll kind of get started here kind of turn our way away from the shore it looks like there's also a few people over here also kind of docked up which would actually be pretty cool to kind of dock up right next to them but I think that we'll probably do a little bit more cruising around and then head in This was pretty cool and this boat was so large that we just keep it in the water all the time just because it's pretty hard to trailer a 40 foot boat, almost impossible, pretty much is and uh, it's pretty cool driving the uh, GT3 RS, uh, pretty cool Porsche sports car, one of my favorite cars and it's pretty cool to feature a pretty cool sports car and a giant boat. So I think now, since we did do a little bit of boating, we'll be heading back in and we'll be calling it a day. But it might take us a little bit longer to, to kind of dock up since it is a pretty large boat. It looks like there's a police boat over there. So we do not really want to make a wake once we kind of come in. And you guys can see that the waves do pretty much slow down also once we kind of come in. But it's actually pretty hard to see over the front of the boat as we cruise in. This yacht is pretty cool. Both of these mods I did get off GTA5mods.com. We'll be doing many more, probably a few more towing, repoing, and we'll be looking for new boats and uh, also some off-roading ones. Should be coming very soon. So hope you guys are excited for those. Take a look. There's a boat going by. Looks like they have something extra up, like a little canopy. Looks like we could have actually added that, but I thought that we should just kind of have the boat just as is. So we are just about back here at the marina. We'll hop back in the GT3. And I will uh, head back over to the apartment. Wow, we are coming a little too close to the shoreline. So this will be definitely a little interesting kind of backing in. We don't have to take that exact same slip. But if we can, that would be pretty nice. You guys can see that that's the machine that lifts them out of the water. That would be pretty cool if we could get one of those in farms. But we'll kind of try to maneuver. I did try this before the video started that way uh, I did know that it was possible and I uh, would not run into major problems so we kinda got this looks like there's a few more cars here from the last time we got this on our first try guys that is pretty cool it looks like this is good we'll kinda freeze it right away it will not move and then we'll kind of uh, hop out and we'll head back to our apartment now you could actually use this board to kind of walk back, but we didn't go too far back. I do not want to go too, too far, but wow. We'll be walking back up here into the Porsche GT3 
911 RS. This is one epic car. Take a look at it. This blue really does stand out. It's a GTA 5 blue, and it looks pretty cool. So we'll hop back in it. I think that this car would look pretty cool. Blacked out wheels, and I believe Porsche does uh, do that. So hope you guys enjoyed today's video. We will now head back off camera. Thanks for watching. Have a great day, and subscribe for more.